It's a great day to talk Healthy Heart Month here at the Fabio Chiropractic and Sports Rehab. And it's February, it's Valentine's Day, and it is National Healthy Heart Month. And we were checking Mike's blood pressure, why? Because chiropractic and blood pressure go hand in hand together, they really do. There are five factors that control your blood pressure. Three of them are directly related to chiropractic procedures and adjustments of the spine. The five factors are how hard your heart beats, how fast your heart beats, the diameter of your blood vessels, the thickness of your blood, and the volume of your blood. Those are physiologically the five things that control everybody's blood pressure. The diameter of your blood vessels, the strength of your heart contractions, and how fast your heart contracts are muscular functions that are controlled by nerves, nerves that come out of your spine, Chiropractic adjustments, traditional chiropractic adjustments impact the spine, impact those nerves, affect the nerve impulses, create homeostasis, remember that from our other video, and by doing that, it balances the blood pressure. Is it the only thing you do? No, you can also do uh, nutraceuticals, omega-3 fatty acids are great for blood pressure management. If you're retaining water and you need to move a little bit more water, well, get off the gluten because that binds water, but also maybe some diuretics like uh, a dandelions, a natural diuretic, a red clover, lots of herbs that can move fluid a little bit as well. Blood pressure management is important. Cardiovascular disease is the number one killer in America. Watch your blood pressure. You want to keep it in the normal range. 120 over 80, Mike's, yours was great, so good job. Um, low intensity cardiovascular activity is also very beneficial for blood pressure management. Not hard, but LSD, long slow distance, is really good to help open up those blood vessels. It'll reduce tension in the area. Hey, you gotta be anti-inflamed, you gotta get rid of inflammation of your blood vessels because inflammation of your blood vessels creates plaquing, creates narrowing of those blood vessels. So that means good fats, anti-inflammatory diet. There's lots you can do. Are we the only game in town? No, we aren't the only game in town. However, you gotta keep that blood pressure within a normal range, otherwise, you're at risk for developing cardiovascular disease. Get it checked. Come to our office. We do it for free for anybody. You don't have to be a patient, but keep an eye on it and make good lifestyle choices. It's been a great day to talk Healthy Heart Month with you. Keep up the good work and please like and share this information.